enjoyed the most and it's been quite good and I've enjoyed the refreshments. I feel like you picked, picked up a good few hints and tips tonight. Oh, yeah, definitely, yeah. yeah. I've got my notes and things like that and I'm definitely taking them forward as well. Fantastic, thank you. You're the low rider. The low rider is a little higher. So, what have you found out tonight? Anything that struck you as, stand, as being particularly helpful? Uh, I really like just a review of some of the multimedia online tools because you always forget. <laughs> Okay, uh, interesting teach bit so far. Uh, good, good mix of presentations. I think the, um, the, the the nuggets that I'll take home with me is, is a first of all, um, having the scouts here and reminding us all that um, learning doesn't just take in place in school; it also happens within an outdoor learning environment as well. That links in quite nicely with the geocaching presentation, um, which is talking about World War Two and linking that in with uh, real environments. Um, but the also thing that I liked is um, is the stuff about the Four Nations Math Challenge as well. I've used mathematics in school. I think that'll be really, really successful and popular. Thank you. Oh, no, hold on. They were filming. What have been the most, what have you found most entertaining about today? Creativity in everything. And it's applicable to everyone, every age, anywhere. All right, that's good. My favourite bit of cheat sheet so far has been uh, Gavin Oates and his subconscious twiddling of polos and a piece of bread. Also the practical geocaching and yeah, just lots of interesting ideas for future teaching. And things you think you may be able to implement for yourself. Yeah. And uh, would you think you maybe that in the future you could come here with an idea for yourself to, to pass on to other teachers? Uh, it's possible, yeah. Um, <laughs> hopefully I'll have some more teaching experience and feel more confident to give my own ideas. Fantastic. And the mingling, have you have you had a chance to speak to other other teaching professionals tonight. Yeah, absolutely. It's an interesting mix of um, different. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Eve. <laughs> a good mix of uh, different uh, aspects of it. On camera, I'll stand right here. Uh, yeah. Yes, I really like the presentation from the scout representative because uh, I was a scout. Here he is here because uh, I was a scout leader for 11 years, and I, I really seen the benefits that it can give children in developing their confidence and uh, you know cooperative skills. It really is amazing, and as you say, it's been it's curriculum for excellence, but being done for years. Okay. Ross, would you like to add a few, 10 seconds? Sorry. I'm just going to go and get her a volunteering flyer so that she can become a scout leader again. Okay. There you go. <laughs> so what would, you, what would be a message to people who are watching this? It was really about uh, recognising wider achievement. Um, the scouts are an educational um, organisation. We're all about developing young people. Uh, although we do it in a non-formal way uh, that a lot of children find a lot more uh, engaging and uh, they can achieve a lot more. In. And you rely on volunteers? We rely on volunteers. We've got 40,000 members in Scotland and that's all run by volunteers. Okay. Uh, we've only got about maybe 20 paid members of staff across the country. And if you want to volunteer? If you want to volunteer, go to scouts.org.uk forward slash join and you'll find it. Excellent, thank you. Um, what am I being asked again? <laughs> um, share some good practice, or what's been the best, what would you tell? Oh, the best, right, I'll tell you the best bit. The best bit was finding out about different educational websites that I've not heard about. That was definitely good, because I can go and look and research them all in time and find out about them. Excellent, thank you. So, 
how do you think it's how do you think it's gone so far? Um, it's going all right. Yeah, thank you. It's going fine. Bronze seems to be enjoying themselves. Yeah, and anything particular stood out for you as a um, young teacher? I particularly enjoyed I, I actually the polo trick. Gavin Oates's polo trick was particularly impressive. Something you might take into the classroom Something yourself. Something I might take into the classroom myself. Yeah. Um, Lots of good things, though. lots of really good online IT resources for children. So you think you might organise another one fairly at some point soon? Maybe. <laughs> well, thank you for that fantastic interview. Miss right,